Hi, I'm Holly, a podcaster, journalist and content creator. So I spoke to five people who are way ahead of me right now in knowing who they are. And I got to hear about their lives as people who are LGBTQ+. I love to talk about any sort of issue that is current and in people's minds, whether that be LGBTQ plus rights, feminism, or the environment. I also wanted to hear about what it's like to be gay. So I met up with Alexander Leon. I genuinely don't know if I have to do those so high up. I like the <laughs> theatre like of it. Yeah, it's very much. <laughs> Alex is a writer and campaigner, and I don't know his star sign, but he's certainly full of wisdom when it comes to coming out. Not all plant-based foods are entirely green. I love an avocado as much as the next millennial, but if it has to fly thousands of miles to get to your sourdough, then you might have been better off in terms of greenhouse gas emissions with a chicken sandwich. Since the murder of Sarah Everard, lots of people have come here to Cuff and Bandstand to pay their respects. But it's also raised a bigger question in society around women's safety in general. This last year has given us a lot of time for introspection. And for some reason, in a crisis or upheaval, people turn to poetry. What is the process of writing longer form writing like that, like for you, versus poetry? Well, uh, the way I've done it is with the aid of a, a tape recorder. Podcasts are big business. But what exactly is a podcast? Why is everyone raving about them? And are big businesses really spending that much? So I run a podcast in which I interview authors and celebrities, basically anyone who's written a book, be that Julie Andrews or the latest kind of heavy tome. And I get to basically meet loads of interesting people. What holds together so many communities are the small gatherings, the dance groups, religious groups, youth groups. Next up, Happiness Becomes You by Tina Turner. Thanks, Tina. So I didn't know that Buddhism has been a big part of Tina's life for decades. Forgive me, Tina Turner fans. So I'm about to chat to Josh, who is a super avid walker, to see where he thinks we should be going this year. This summer, where would you recommend that they go for some really great walks? So I've got my, I guess, my favourite locations around the country. Porn isn't going anywhere. So if it's out there and if we're going to watch it, it ought to be in an ethical way. But what does ethical porn really mean? Young LGBTQ plus people represent about a quarter of the youth homelessness population, with many saying it's a direct result of their sexuality. First up, we have Call Me By Your Name by Andre Eichmann. This is holiday romance meets coming of age. It sweeps you away to Italy. You're in the countryside. The air is hot but fresh. People are spending endless hours refreshing online product pages, only for it to be stolen at the very last minute by the bots. 